We are at the Dublin Distance Fiesta. This is the girls 1600 Hardman, 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 Emily Kelkin, <coughs> Carmen Stangus, Michaela Chacon, Sadie Shepherd, Kay Kame, Frenchelle Kalmorin, Anjie Zhu, Adeline Lee, Milana Kozlova, Alyssa Tempongo, Vivian Boone, Lily Tai, Kathy Chen, Addison Seanwald, Lucia Riggs, Caitlin Venkastami, Margaret Kramer, Isabella Park, Natalie Robart, Caitlin O'Donnell, 200 meters, Macy a little bit Lee more Jones, relaxed than Gia was early in Aisling her race. Evers, Sophie Middleman, Greta Sharma, Melanie Abrego, and Lily Gonzalez. And that's Sophie Middleman of Camel Pies. Uh, through in about 138. Right next to each other. And the field comes through in about 141. 147 is 400 meters. That's a little bit slower than what Gia ran. We'll see if they can the be a little bit more consistent. For everybody, pace-wise, everyone here is seated between 7.26 and 8 minutes. That's going to be... K is going to go around. Okay. You can follow along on live results, all the actions. Heat three, heat three, come on over. Final instructions, we're going to get on the track. Heat three, heat three. Guys with timing, doing a great job. Time at all these races. Sorry, Atkins timing. There are QR codes posted around the track. Click on that and you can follow the live results in real time. 246, so. And if you want to know what section we're on, you can look up at the for that 200. press box and you'll see the event and the heat number. Right now it says 162. This is the girls' 1600 section 2. So we see these ladies kind of. It's important for a little bit behind that where we, we won't do Gia was at this point in the race, but they're making up ground. So follow along, you know what heat you're in. Make to sure you get down to the field and get checked in. So far. And we're coming up on the halfway point right around 323 for Middleman of Tamil Pius. <laughs> Okay, so right next to each other. Chance to break seven minutes. We're a good chunk to this field right now. And at this point, they're a little bit faster than what Gia was, by about a second. <laughs> Forty-six. He was at three forty-seven, and she got half to halfway. And I think the same thing that I would say about Gia, I would say about Caitlin and Kay. Third lap is going to be huge. And to keep this lap around two minutes, keep it under two minutes, is great. <laughs> Group of four hits the home stretch for the penultimate time here. 447, so that was about 61 seconds for that 200. 
So that's a little bit over eight minute pace. Looks like they may be making a little Still bit under of five movement. minutes here. Emily Kelkin of Rio to the front. They really look like that she's fast. Tezgadol of maybe Alameda. The fourth lap, but she, she hasn't made Sophie that Sophie Middleman of Tamil Pius still there. But if Kay passed Caitlin, it might help Caitlin a little Emily bit. Emily Kelkin, the freshman from Rio Americano. They are making up ground on the, the separate all the front of them, so. About 201, 202 on that lap. Let's see what they've got left for the lap. Everyone passing through the finish line, still on pace for personal best. Everyone running very well in these first two sections. Taking advantage of this great opportunity here at the Dublin Distance Fiesta. And early ahead of that eight minute pace. On the home stretch. And a late push here. From Middleman. Your early leader starting to fire back now. Kelkin and Middleman. Kelkin's going to be your Heat 2 winner. Right around 646. Middleman. And Rio Americano. So they've got Carmen Stangus. They're going to be under eight. So Rio goes one, That's three. Cool. Can they bring it home? Nice finish there for Greta Sharma, Amira Loma. Now K goes around, Caitlin. Natalie Robards, the whole race. all under 715 here. Remember, everyone entered at 726 and above. So PRs all across the finish line right now. And Kay's got something left. 734. We're gonna have Caitlin at 738. Big PRs for both. 